Have you seen crystals of salts? Crystals are made through a process of crystallization. Let us try to make salt crystals from a solution of salt. For this we need thread, a saturated solution of copper sulphate and copper sulphate. First we will make a super saturated solution of copper sulphate. Light the spirit lamp, place the copper sulphate solution on the burner, heat the mixture. Now keep on adding copper sulphate till no more salt is dissolved. Fasten a thread on a support and suspend it in an empty glass. This thread will act as a nucleation center in the container. Now remove the solution from the burner. Pour the solution in the glass. Leave the glass aside for a few days. We see salt crystals formed on the string. This happens because the solubility of salt in water increases with temperature of solution. So more salt gets accommodated in the solution than it would have if water was at room temperature. This solution is called a supersaturated solution. The salt from this supersaturated solution gets precipitated out when the solution returns to room temperature. The salt molecules that get precipitated out start forming crystals at the nucleation center, which is the thread in this case. Crystallization is the process of formation of solid crystals of a substance by precipitating it out from a saturated solution. Why don't you try making sugar crystals at home?